Blah, 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 blah. People, people, settle down. Okay, now, how many of you have played musical instruments before? Do instruments of torture count? No. Is mayonnaise an instrument? No, Patrick, mayonnaise is not an instrument. Horseradish is not an instrument either. <laughs> Hello, my fellow hunters, and welcome to a wonderful world of weird, an eclectic, exciting experience of explosions, without many explosions, actually, this time around. But either way, things are going ridiculous, and I will let you enjoy them all. Well, first of all, of course, as always, mods. Hey, it's like boobs. Oh. No, Glacier, no! Get it, get it. Weird. I feel like this might genuinely be the most annoying combination of three monsters in the whole of world. So what have you done today? Nothing. What have you done today? My life is very boring. I, I to know. went to see Fatalis. Did you did that today? How are you back already? Yeah, that was a uh, very fast trip. You know, I remember the boat took two weeks to get here in the first time. Oh, well, I, 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 uh, I got a first class seat on a Valstrex. Oh, that's very nice. I imagine that Fatalis has a private Valstrex. <laughs> yeah, of course, he has a private Valstrex, and I caught it, caught it there, and, and then I robbed him. I, w I was going to ask if you think that Valstrex would be strong enough to support flying a Fatalis somewhere, but I think that takes priority. Yeah, no, I stole Fatalis' weapons. He, he has weapons? Yep. He has a real, uh, eye for them, smoke bomb! Wow, that was a smoke bomb. Sorry, I saw saw something horrific. Get it? Yeah. I for we weapon. I, I. What are you talking about? I don't see. Was something changed? I can't tell. Look at your back. Oh, look at that! Exactly. Yeah, there's an eye. Yeah. Do you like my glowing ridge tail? It, oh, it's a tail. Look, the glowing ridge top part looks like a squirming maggot. Oh, I was imagining one of his horns, but you know, you can go whatever you want to. Oh yeah, it could be his horns. Oh, also, by the way, smoke bomb! Hello, Cotton. Hello. Who are you? Are you mocking my voice? No, I just talk deeper around people I don't know. That's very weird. I think it's actually a normal thing for human psychology. <laughs> Look it up, weird man. This is the outfit I used to steal from Fatalis! Why is your head so long? I thought it would help! Are you one of the aliens from Indiana Jones and the Kingdom of the Crystal Skull? <laughs> Do not mock my shadow stealing outfit. Is it just to like balance you backwards so you can lean forward all the time? Like the Pixar lamp? Stop mocking my extended cranium! <laughs> Are you gonna start jumping up and down on eyes now? It lets me glide! <laughs> What does it let you glide on? <laughs> Ice? Is it a toboggan for your head? <laughs> I feel very ashamed. I've made so many great jabs. I'm just saying this is great. <laughs> I didn't expect a roast. Oh, where, what happened to your back panel? I, I, I used the material for the head extension. <laughs> Wait, if you, if you, if you, like, if you look straight up, I think you'll cover your back with the head. Fuck off! <laughs> so. So. Stop mocking my voice in this. I'm not, I just don't know you. I'm less comfortable around you. Behold. How cool does this look? Oh, it's, oh, look at the trail. That's neat. Look at us. We're like actual hell at I'm a real boy! If we do this enough, it opens a portal to hell. Or to Doctor Strange, based on the way it looks. <laughs> well, one or the other, it's gonna open any time now. Wait, hey, it's like boobs. I was gonna say it's uh, infinite power. <laughs> really, that's, Same thing. Uh, that's, Same uh, thing! That really highlights the difference between <laughs> you and I. 
Infinite Look, power! I'm sorry. <laughs> Boobs. <laughs> Look, man, you put two circles with two things in the middle of them right next to each other, and that's what it is. I didn't go all the way up to fucking <laughs> Castle Strain and be like, hey, Fidelis. And he's like, hello. And I'm like, how are you doing? And he's like, pretty lonely. And I'm like, well, that's because you, you killed everyone. And he's like, yes, I did. And I'm like, can I have two of your weapons? And he's like, no. And I was like, well, I took him anyway. And he was like, come back here. So I could come all the way over here for you to fucking mock them. Oh, I, I thought you were going to say, Hey, Vitalis, I need your weapons. No! <laughs> but please, I need them so I can draw boobs with my partner in the sand. <laughs> well, okay then. Yeah, all right, here you go. <laughs> Behold! <laughs> Black it's... Ebony Odogaron. Oh, oh. Oh, they fixed his tail! Yeah! <laughs> and they made his head kind of white, so he looks like a bone mask. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's actually really neat. Yeah. I really like the face. Yeah. when I, That when part I, specifically. Initially, when I was like, Dark Ebony and Ogron, but wait, isn't he already like, it's, that's literally yeah. his color screen, but it, it actually is really, like, this This is how I, he should have looked. Like, yeah, this is like Tribal Odogaron. Yeah. I dig oh, that. Oh, it is! It's totally like Tribal Odogaron, like the face, bone mask, the red markings. Yeah, the red, it's like Ooh. tattoos. Yeah. You could totally That's see really a neat. tribe of Odogaron being like, meat. You know what? I will say it, Kurd Osin. I think Odogaron should have always looked like this. I love the kind of skull mass tribally feel. I've always felt the sort of oil slick purpley tail was a little bit kind of random, not exactly suiting him, and the blood flecks might be a bit too much, but I like the idea of him being pure darkest night. So the red as he lights up with dragon has such intense contrast. And either way, this is a lot of fun, as is the goddamn Fatalis weapons, taking a little eyeball and pluck it into the side. Because the thing is, it's not a Fatalis eye, because it's too small. So, whoever made this just took an eye of something and just glued it on. And it changes color. It might be still alive. But either way, it's good to see the Fatalis weapons. The Ruiner Glaive back once more. And that glowing, gorgeous effect on it is just breathtaking. It's an absolute pleasure to use. So good work, Akinusaka. Good work. On with the show. Yeah. That's uh, that's mainly their one word. Meat. meat. I like meat. Well, they're they're like hairless wolves. Hairless wolves. No wolf <laughs> should be hairless. No, they shouldn't. But people do it to dogs. People do it to cats. It happens. I think they and people do it to wolves. Yeah, see, like, who do you know bear? that's going through the goddamn forest skinning wolf hair? You seen a hairless bear? It's just weird. But I've seen a bearless hair. Me too. That's most hair that I look at. <laughs> it's a pretty good state for hair to be in. Is bearless. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I, I would prefer not to find hair that had a bear inside of it, just sitting there, lying in wait. <laughs> would you rather fight a hairless bear or a bearless hair? Bearless hair. <laughs> okay. I think I could win pretty easily. <laughs> well, I'm only trying to kill the hair, so just a light fire. Well, what about a hair with a bear or a bear with a hair? Uh... A bear with a hair, because technically there's less, because I imagine the, the hair with a bear also has the bear with hair. Unless you're saying that the hair has a hairless bear. <laughs> no, it's a it's a hair it's a hair with hair with a bear with hair that has a bear without hair. What? Why does Ariel Insect Glaive have to suck? I like how that bug, just as he fell asleep, gave him such a slap <sighs> that you could hear it just echo against his fleshy cheeks. Roll! <laughs> oh, 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 we can use the Legiana as a weapon against the, the Tribogoron. Tribogoron. Uh, this sounds like an Odogoron with three heads. Why is nobody <laughs> putting a monster to have multiple heads? Why don't we have a Cerberus monster in the first place? Because it's really disadvantageous to have multiple heads. Yeah, yeah, but if Not he didn't bad. have a tail, he'd fall over every time he did any jumping. Yeah, but you could say that for every monster that it does I like guess, jumping. I guess in fairness, or if he didn't have any legs, he'd fall and... over every time he jumped. Yeah. I think it's the most important thing for movement. Like, he can walk with a tail and no legs. He cannot walk with... The wait, 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 whoa, whoa. He can walk the with way. a tail wrong and way. no wrong legs? Way. Sorry, way. explain to me the motion with which the Sodogaron can walk with a tail but no legs. You ever seen a snake? <laughs>
<laughs> I don't think that quite works with his body shape. I think more he'd slap the tail Look, against the ground. He would do his best. And use it as, like, propulsion. <laughs> Yeah, he becomes an aquatic mammal, but he needs air, so he has to be able to flap and paddle. <laughs> <laughs> Who put this legless Odogaron in my pool? <laughs> yeah, he lives in shallow pools. That's it. He can only survive in a shallow pool. <laughs> so they inhabit small rivers. I don't think taking its legs away suddenly <laughs> means it needs to inhabit small rivers. I think it should inhabit them. I want you to know that I genuinely walked past this sort of uh, shell yeah. arrangement here, and I genuinely, for a second, had a thought of, oh, I should pick that up and sell you it. You're fucking crazy. You should take your net out. It could be a hermit crab. <laughs> Look, it's also Dark Nagakuga. Oh my god, how did this happen? Tribal Nagakuga. <laughs> Ooh, Tribal Turf War. He really is fighting everything as a Sodogoron. Well, that's, that's part of his life. He has that mentality. He I does. think him and Rajang would be good Aww. friends. Either that or the bitterest of enemies. Is that how a coral pookie pookie is born? Just a normal pookie pookie that drinks too much water? Yeah, of course. It just fills their poison sack and then it never goes back. <laughs> it fills their the poison sack! Water, it never goes back. <laughs> <laughs> the pookie pookie are like, guys, you gotta try this. Honestly, it's fantastic. <laughs> Like, come on, you'll never regret it. And all the other Pookie Pookies are just like, man, he's weird. He's like a Pookie Vegan. That's he's like he a Pookie Vegan. Flush. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, hello. I like how you just came into that. Apparently, I summoned you. Ow. No trap. No trap for you. Okay, I'm not trapping. Oh, oh no, no, do trap. No, we do do it. Then yes, don't trap. say no yes, trap. trap for you. I didn't expect you to listen to me. Oh, Ugh. fuck you, Ebony Odogaron. We shall capture this rare specimen in the name of specimen capture. And then we will fire pods into the distance for no reason. Oh, hey, Publess. Oh, hey, Cotton. Want to see something cool? Oh, absolutely. Well, watch this. Sorry, I can't turn my head at all. What, what did you do? Oh, gosh darn it! Alright, follow me in my tail. Also, I have a tail now. I, I definitely noticed. Alright, shh. We finished the walk. I know it was a long, grueling walk. I know we went through howling blizzards and scorching lightning and lava rivers too. But now we're here. Why, why did I have to stop before you? Um... It's really uh, weird that I'm back here. I can't uh, hear you. Okay, I'm just yelling at those, uh... Are, those, there, uh, are there blue rabbits in blue. front of us? They are Glaceon! Thank you very much! A uh, god, good, honest to goodness Pokemon! Yeah! <laughs> Mine. Well done. I caught one! I'm proud of you. You're now a Pokemon trainer! Sweet, now I can go into the tall grass. Where is it? <laughs> <laughs> Just hear horrific monster sounds and screaming and blood and <laughs> crashing. <laughs> uh, how's that? How's that single glacial helping? <laughs> I need another glacial. <laughs> He's come back covered in blood. Oh, blood smoke transition. Blood smoke. Go, Pokenet! Oh God, I missed. Oh. Oh, go, Pokenet! Yes, I caught a Glaceon! Tail transition! So what do you think of my tail? It's orange and white. And now, the rest of me! Oh, surprise! What, what's up with your colors, though? I, I, do, I just, you know, I just, I like, I like purple, white, black, pink, oh, orange. I just, I just like being a rainbow fox! I'm a rainbow fox! and you will obey me. Well, I'm just a pink fox. <clears throat> <laughs> walk also, me, walk away. <laughs> imagine if you could summon from the sky a Shara Ishvalda beam. Like, okay. boom! It, it, uh, uh, what it, it, oh, it just, it didn't. You just, um, you, uh, um, let's try oh, again. Oh, okay. Boom! 
Oh, that's pretty neat. Does that hurt me? Yeah. Look at that. Okay. Why, yeah, why, yeah, that's nice. Why would why why is your response to that is oh should I stand in it? Is this really painful? Oh! Well, I need to, I need to know before we get into deadly combat. I need to know if the monsters are gonna hurt as much as it's hurting me. Well, if I if I know I can stand in something, it changes the existence of my movement ideas. Look, it's a bow Ooh. blessed with the magic of Shara Ishvalda. Known for his Damn. magic ability. It's so pretty. Ooh, so what I thought would be really, really fun is yeah. to oh, 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 oh! Look at that! That was oh! I wonder if we could like shoot ships as they try and dock and then make them sink. The, like like a lighthouse, but not helpful. They're, fr they're, they're friendly ships, though. They're but not like imagine if a lighthouse keeper had a laser gun and was shooting ships. That's called a guard tower. Look, what I thought would be really fun outside of sinking ships was to do the world's most annoying quest possible. Okay, what is it? Behold! A N Viper oh. Toby Kodachi, Nightshade Palumu, and Namiel. Yeah, I mean, this seems fun to me, I guess. <laughs> Two out of three are tempered. <laughs> Why would anyone design this quest? Poppy head, why would you do this? Why would you, why would you put this combination of awfulness before us? I, I hate you, but god damn, I respect you. I love the idea of making ridiculous custom hunts that, the, you know, I feel like would never actually be added because people would be breaking controllers left and right, but it's nice to experience the, uh, challenge, as it is very nice to be firing pure magic from Jack Gelano's Shara bow and hand, seeing that beam come from the sky is just glorious, yes indeed. So keep on keeping on, and I cannot wait to see what beauty pours forth from your creative hands. That's an interesting way to phrase that now that I, now that I say it out loud. How do you feel about being poisoned, slept, and covered in water? Oh, just perfect, really. Oh, just lovely. Lovely, <laughs> lovely, lovely. How excited are you for this endeavor? Well, I know which one I'd like to get rid of first. I can tell you that much. Is it the Nightshade Palumu? It's the Nightshade Palumu. He will get <laughs> us all killed. Hey, he also put Nami out to sleep, to he be He does fair. put them to sleep, so. Exactly. It's not terrible. Oh, we even doing the little jumpy it. shifts make a little burst of magic appear. Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, bomb! God, I love firing laser beams. Same. They're fun. How long will we survive? That's the qu Ow. question. Three. We will survive three. Oh, I'm excited to survive three. Oh, I'm going to sleep, but then he woke oh, me up with more sleep. No! Yes! I don't like to see this, well, see. <gasps> Covered in sleep gas yeah, on top of it as I'm being I don't dragged really around. Like the idea of yeah, sl the sleep gas, and then I'm being dragged into the sleep gas yes. by the water. <laughs> and then also, deadly poison. Although Viper yeah. did just get slapped onto the ground, which makes me very happy. Oh, I sort of, at this point, I feel sleepy, like the answer sleep. is to get rid of the Namiel while the Namiel is getting paralyzed and slept repeatedly. That is true. Oh, okay, fine. Just just yell at the Namiel. I understand. And that Viper Toby Ooh, Kodachi is so tiny. Dragon he is tiny. Both the tinier monsters are, are, are tinier than average. Yeah. Oh, hello, Palumu. I am kind of surprised that I'm still alive. Why am I on such little health? I forgot I was poisoned. <laughs> I still I have like my ears while well, having a mental on. Uh, you do. I do. <laughs> I'm just going to beam him from above. It's all good. Oh, the, uh, the Viper is asleep now as well. Oh, oh God, this quest sucks! Yeah, it's weird. I'm literally only going to use barrels from now on. That's my new gameplay style. Okay. Um, can I ask why? Because it's cool and fun, and I can hit three of them at the same time if they pile up. You know what we need? We need clouds of poison as well. We need, like, a Giginox or a Chameleos to join this party. Are you saying that Viper Toby Kodachi isn't good enough? I just got hit by a tidal wave full of rocks while falling asleep. I saw. That's also the name of my band. Oh, I just got hit by a tidal wave full of rocks while falling asleep. It was the really jerk. painful, but I was drowsy. <laughs> I feel like this might genuinely be the most annoying combination of three monsters in the whole of the world. I don't know. I mean, I think specifically because I'm using bow, the sleep is affecting me less than it normally does with Nightshade. I guess maybe you could replace Viper with Valhazak. Maybe. That would probably be terrifying. Oh, Christ. Oh! 
Imagine just Valhazak sucking in death clouds while Nightshade sucks in sleep clouds while Namiel throws you around with the water. I really thought you were going to say, well, Namiel sucks in water, and I was like, do you just want to see monsters absorb substances? I love seeing absorbing oh monsters. Oh my god, my kill screen! Oh, Jesus! I have literally Namiel, Viper, and Palumu in fucking formation silhouetted by Namiel's wings all staring me down! As rocks clobber me. <laughs> okay, guys. <laughs> Way to pose. What's your theme song? We are weird partners and we are together. I am Viper Toby Kanachi and I'm the weakest member. Goodbye. <laughs> Why did he just add that at the end? <laughs> because he's also <laughs> really weak on a social level. Stop staring intently at the hublash. Well, I want to know what she has to say, but she hasn't said anything for a while. I'm just looking at this book thinking about life, just like, come on, just just tell me what I can do. Well, there's your mods. And this is my hair. And this yeah, is my hair. By the way, that last quest was not fair. Not again. Oh, I'm sorry! <laughs> <laughs> and this is my hairless, bearless hair. What? <laughs> mods! mods. Oh yes, everybody, that is your mods for the day, and it's been quite the experience. From flying to Spongebob and everything else in between and around it, we've had quite the time. And yes, you have had quite the time. Fun, of course, is mandatory here. Let me know what your favorite was. All of them can be found in the description below. Like if you enjoyed this, subscribe for more, and I'll see you soon. A good boy. This is the brand new outro to tell you all the things that you do that we love So let's start with something simple and say Oh we love your eyes When they're watching us play video games When we make a bunch of jokes that are kinda lame And when they gaze upon our failures as we try to kill the monsters Or report important news about the kingdom and Amelia Rage, Cotton, and Hollow are all here Talking about the things you want to hear So if you want to be the first to hear Like and subscribe and the bell and we'll cheer Some of you are patrons even though We are all the noobs and you're the pros There's nothing we can do to thank you No, really, there's nothing we could possibly do. Goodbye. Oh, it's so pretty.